Absolutely. And don't forget so ACC Ambuja, which oh, we yes. presented as well. Yes, you know, yes, just yes. need to chip in there. Right. <laughs> okay, <laughs> well, uh, point, a word yes. in for cement. Uh, we, we got uh, market open coming up in just a bit. What the, the Nifty is absolutely flat, uh, twenty-four thousand two eighty. Uh, the Nifty Bank is starting slightly higher, about a quarter percent. Uh, Fifty-two thousand four hundred and twenty is where the Nifty Bank is at. Uh, so it's uh, slightly higher uh, at this point in time. Uh, what else? Small cap index is up a third. Remember, broader markets did very well yesterday. Uh, the small cap index, especially one and a third of a percent higher. You know, all these new age companies, uh, newer age companies, as you say, it's all relative. But you know, uh, Swiggy did well yesterday. The recent listing, Sigility, which works with insurance uh, ecosystem in the US, did well yesterday. Ola was up, locked up, limit up after uh, getting smashed over the last many uh, days. And of course, uh, you know, Paytm has been the other mover. Uh, and uh, there was that UBS call which we highlighted as well. So uh, <clears throat> that's the start. 20 points, 24,300, around 24,300. I mean, it's good. You don't want a huge gap up or anything, and then you know you spend the rest of the day trying to defend it. A slow start, maybe even a slightly lower start, and then uh, if the market wants to move up, it gives more room. We've got, uh, <clears throat> as far as the Nifty heat map is concerned, 35 up and about 15 stocks which are lower. Uh, so it's a decent looking session. Uh, this uh, Thursday morning. Ola is up another 6%, up yeah. to 20% yesterday. And what a way to go for this one. Uh, and by the way, the Adani group that we were just discussing, the rebound on those stocks is continuing. That's the other major highlight of the morning so far. Stocks are rallying anywhere between 3% all the way up to 8 9%. Look at Adani, Energy Solutions, Total Gas, Green, Adani Power, all of them. And the ones on the Nifty, Adani Enterprise and uh, Ports. Uh, all of them, 2% to 10%, depending on which stock you're picking up this morning. Aside of that, let's talk about the big movers and shakers on the index itself. Lever is contributing, ITC is contributing, HDFC Bank, LNT, these are some of the heavyweights on the upside of the screen. HDFC Life is having a good start to trade today, almost a percent and a half up thereabouts. Sriram Finance, which has had a great week so far, uh, it's seeing some green at the start on Thursday as well, so not too bad. However, on the downside, there is a profit taking and a bunch of uh, tech names. Infosys is down. There is uh, Tech Mahindra also on the lower side of the screen. HCL Tech is a little lower. Reliance is very, very quiet. And auto stocks are seeing some profit taking. Aisha is down 1%. M&M is lower. Bajaj Auto is lower, as is Maruti. So, auto not in top gear today. Okay, well, uh, <clears throat> we got, uh, so it's a, a quite a start, and uh, but things may pick up as we go along. Uh, the first very rates up uh, on your uh, screens. Uh, at uh, this stage. What do we have? It's actually like a traffic light blinking red and green and nothing on it to uh, show for it. Uh, you know, so we'll have uh, uh, maybe a couple of more stocks uh, before we bring in our uh, market master of the day. Madhu Kela is uh, our market master. Uh, so we'll go cross when he's ready. Uh, we've got, uh, by the way, the, the top three, four uh, biggest volume-led movers are all Adani names. Adani Power is up 4%, Adani Green is up 7%, Adani Energy Solutions is up 7.5%, and Adani Total is up about 7%. So it's day two in terms of repair and recovery as far as these group of uh, stocks are concerned. I can spot names like Garden Reach ship, uh, Shipbuilders. We were just having that defense discussion earlier. Uh, and uh, uh, Cochin Shipyard is up about 5% or so. So, yeah, I mean, uh, it's not a bad-looking screen uh, at all. Madhu Kela is now with us, founder of NK Ventures. Uh, he's our market master of the day. Madhu, great to have you back on the program. Thank you very much for joining us. Uh, uh, Prashant, this side. Uh, uh, Madhu, since we're talking after a while, uh, it would be good to sort of get... Okay, I think the connection dropped. Uh, we'll just have him back uh, in a bit. So, do you want to add something? Yeah, in the, in the meantime, I was just yeah. looking at some more stocks. Remember, a lot of these companies that have announced order wins. Look at KAC International, Hoodco, NBCC. All of them are up and about. Some stocks that are reacting to news flow. So all the order winners are doing well, 3% to about 6-7%. Uh, and uh, there is also PCBL. PCBL has got uh, the allotment of uh, some SEZ land. In I think it was in Andhra. Uh, that's a stock that's reacting quite well to that development, 3 3.5% up. So these are some of the newsmakers doing well. But yeah, I mean, the, the morning really belongs to the Adani group all mm. over again. Those stocks doing really well. You know, HBL Power is up. Uh, it was up about 6-7% yesterday. It's up another 2.5% this morning. Uh, and uh, we've got, uh, you know, I, Irda, which is up 4%. I mentioned Garden Reach and Cochin Shipyard. I mean, usually always move as a pack. And Tube Investments was a big mover yesterday. It's up another 2%. Afcon sold off a little bit. It's up 2.5-3%. Two, two there's Capricide Infra, uh, which has been doing well. It's recovered nicely from the lows. 
uh, it's up about 2% as well. This Shilpa Medicare, which is up about 1.5% as well. So a fair bit happening. Two, uh, three is to one in terms of advances to decline. But this is still very early, right out of the gates. So maybe yeah. uh, 15, 20 minutes more, and we'll have a better sense. Madhu Kela,